They're still running and trying to gun, but not getting much done with that as Lycro finally burns Freddy alive. Disco still in place toward the sandbags. No one went water. Now Dennis does! Now Dennis does! And gets two. If his timing was earlier, maybe the opportunity didn't exist because they wouldn't have both been looking the same direction, but he may have been able to save a few teammates. He suddenly finds himself in a one versus two, eating four kills in total to win out the round. Good work about CZ. Want to go down. At this point, they can start triangulating around its position. He's a lot on the side. Chris knows it. Hits as well. Let's tell Dennis he's in the window. And great wow. shot. Reed's Brolin was going to be re-entering from the site. He wasn't already on jungle side due to the Molotov. But still, it brings it to a one-on-one -on -one twist. Is he aware that he's still there? Because the off shot can take him down. They're both on red HP, forcing Dennis to move. And he finally gets around front IP. It took Heroics to find them just their second round. There you go. That's exactly what they needed. Stronger fraggers within the NIP machine. He'll be smoked out, but does find a little bit of damage. And look at Forrest coming in for the long flank through T spawn. He'll have to be instrumental here, Matt, if they can have to stand any sort of chance of holding Ooh, this one off. What? what the hell just happened? Dennis through the smoke finds two headshots to potentially save the round. Unbelievable, because he fell back. He just wanted to stay efficient. He's got a third on Oscar as well. Forrest was looking for information when the call came in that they were at a main, so he committed to the flank. He backed off. He didn't go all the way through spawn because Dennis stepped up considerably, and they thought maybe there was a chance to go back to B. You can see Dennis also rotated off, so still they have to find Rops and Sonny, and Rops anticipates the fact that the flank is coming in. He's already staring that direction. Sonny's going to find Rez, but Rops, only with the Deagle and Sonny on 2 HP, still get caught out and Forrest gets away with it down to eight thankfully it was just the pistol gives Sonny a chance to find one depending on when they go for the defuse but Dennis mm, incredible round from him four kills overall and two of them through small hopefully not soon blanketed in bullets but he could certainly pound them back the other direction if this goes unchecked the problem being if he's the last man up then it's just a matter of trade fragging outwards and the rest of his team have died one after another. Dennis comes in off of the ramp, and this is just going to eject Bomb back up towards a rotation so important on Nuke. Unbelievable. That's totally game the system right there. They used Zipix to get the information and to, to bait everyone to going into lower, so they didn't wait for a reaction. They were ready to go to hit upper. And that puts Dennis in a pretty okay position. He's here in heaven. You can't see into the site. Matt is going to, well, it looks like a 50 50 and goes down. 2v2 now. Swapping out the weapons, closing that distance. Glaive's going to be caught into the open as well. He's looking towards Vents. This is an excellent retake coming out from Nip. Zipex has to clutch, and Dennis denies. Beautiful headshot. Excellent 2v4. players going through Banana. There will be a retake with all 10 players alive. Get right. You can hear so many footsteps in Banana. Can he get kills? He cannot. And that's going to be a real issue for the terrorists now. The downside, though, for the CTs is they're all funneling in a very one-dimensional retake. Crips, however, is going to get himself the first kill. Three on two with Dennis already with two kills. We know what this guy's capable of in pistols, but it's going to be the body block, the interference play to try and stop the terrorists from stopping this defuse, which is happening right now. JW's still on it. Four seconds to go, and Dennis feels like this is a fake. It's not the case. Oh! And he's going to get the kill anyway. All the time, it could not have been worse for JW. I thought it was done. The defuse, it looked, it was on zero. It read zero. F is not afraid of much. And NIP on the other side, of course, having to operate with a lot less than before. And already losing out on Rank is pretty big. That's a good answer from Dennis, though. Gets himself the rifle still to stick by his side rather than losing out. Brings this 4v4, but you can see now Liquid bringing their forces together, and Dennis again is going to be called upon to do a lot of work, and he's up to the top! Oh! Oh, the third as well for Dennis! Steel stood no chance in the end, he is starting to come alive as Twist is in the 1v4. One minute left, Bomb is truly in NIP's den, and I don't see a way back in for Twist. Kills. Kills is what you hope for if you're Twist. It would have to be some kind of miraculous lineup. I don't even know if he would ever even expect. Dennis is going for the ace. Smoke out, he's going to peek with it, and he does get it. All five kills for Dennis. He stands tall. No trading coming out for Team Liquid. This is not easy, even with the timing between the peaks. 